All right, what is going on, guys? Able A so today I'm bringing you guys the Able Uprising Q and A. We asked you guys for a whole bunch of questions. You guys sent us like a whole bunch of questions using hashtag Ask Able. And today I'm joined with Able Slayer and Able Cobra. And today we're going to be reading some of your questions. So we got about 17 questions, like around 16, 17 questions from you guys on Twitter. Uh, as long as you guys use hashtag Ask Able, we're going to read off through a lot of the questions. We're going to. Uh, eh? Uh, <laughs> I don't know what the frick that was. So we're either all going to answer the same question or we're going to, if it's like a question towards a certain person, then we'll answer that certain question. We just want to thank you guys for submitting all your questions. We really do appreciate it. Well, without further ado, we're going to go ahead and get right into the first question. All right, guys. So the first question comes from Jonah Grimm underscore. And he asks, hashtag ask Abel, how many members do you guys currently have? It's, what is that lane? So like, uh, I think it's around 17. 17 or 18. Plots with the CS team as well, which is five. And then we have snipers uh, and editors and stuff like that. So yeah. yeah, it's around 17 members in Able Uprising as of right now. So the next question comes from Reflex, and he asks, why did you guys choose the name Able Uprising? Uh, this is mainly directed towards me, I guess. Um, well, for like Able was started like eight months ago, and you know how every team has their, like, their thing after their like main name? It's either like uh, Militia or Reserve or Uprising or Clan or Team or stuff like that. It's I don't really know how I came up with Uprising, but the team was originally going to be called Cyrenic which is a team that I used to have under my CS when I used to play CSGO competitively and stuff like that. And we already had a logo and it was going to be set, but I really didn't feel like Serenic was a good name because I feel like it didn't really fit as like a friendly thing. So we went ahead and just went with Able Uprising. I don't even remember how I got the name Able, but that's just kind of how it went down. All right, this next question is from Blink. It says, hashtag ask Able, how long has Able been a clan and where do you see this clan in two to five years? Um, I guess that's towards me as well. Uh, Abel, like I said, it's been a team for around like eight to nine months. We're coming up on a year, and where do I see the team in like two to five years? Um, by five years or by four years at least, we should have a team house. And yes. Two to five years, we want to be competing at least two years, competing in a whole bunch of like MLG events and stuff like that with our esports teams, and mainly just getting our name out there further than it already is, and just supporting everything, you know. And one mil subs. Yeah, that, that would be pretty good. All right, so as you guys know, we have ourselves a Counter-Strike team, and we did at one point have a Call of Duty Infinite Warfare team, and we're looking at picking up another one and um, kind of venturing into, you know, the esports organization, uh, looking for, you know, like other teams. Maybe we'll have like a League of Legends team at some point. You never know. We're basically trying to pick up more teams and um, just overall become a really successful esports organization. Yeah, my... Probably my main goal would to be like final goal, like forever would just be a team house. I know a lot of teams have that main goal, but that's something we're really yeah. working for, you know? Oh, okay. I would love a team house. But then, no one freaking out. You cut me off! <laughs> <laughs> well, okay, I'm literally just about to- So next question is coming in from Fly, and he says, if you guys were to get an Able House, which state would it be in and why? Uh, If we were to get an Able House in state location, it either mine would either be say New York, Texas, or Florida. That's what I'm mainly looking at right now, but I don't know. Lane, what do you think? Yeah, I'd agree with Florida just because I like the weather down there, but I also hear the weather in California is nice, except, you know, we got all the fresh water problems. I don't know. Honestly, Florida seems like a good choice. Um, I wouldn't want to move all the way out to California unless it was for, like, a really important job. But, yeah, I'd say Florida is probably the best. Ferrarix asks at Able Uprising, when can I join? Can hear me? <laughs> oh, my God. Actually, kick him. <laughs> Mom. Oh my God. Mom. What? Now is not the time. <clears throat> At all. I'm talking to my clan mates. Hi, clan mates. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> that sounds so nerdy. Small. Hello. Mom Hello. Lord. Hello, Mrs. Jeremiah. Sorry, <laughs> 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 I'm <laughs> Sorry hello, about that. Hello, Mrs. Jeremiah. This <laughs> even makes sense. Go away, you weirdo. Rorix asks at Able Uprising, when can I join? Well, I'm guessing a lot of you guys know right now we have our hashtag are you able thing as well as our hashtag able director. So if you guys are a director, you guys can go check that out as well as hashtag are you able. If you guys are a player, editor, or designer, you guys can go check that out. You have until like January the 31st, so you guys have a long time from now. So if you, any of you guys do want to join Able, that's like the best way to actually get into the team is by going for our recruitment challenge or shows that you're dedicated and stuff like that. That's what we're mainly looking for. Next question is from Connor, and he asks, where do you guys see yourself in a year? 
Uh, we basically added that with the two to five years one, but like I said, we're trying to get into esports a lot more, and we're trying to also balance out our sniping roster so we can upload some more montages for you guys. And other than that, that's for a year. It's mainly dipping into esports a lot more. The next question we have here is from Gabriel, and he says, "Any big teams you look up to?" And wow, I would Rene, take thank you nine. so much for reading okay. off of that uh, question. Yep. I really appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, you're very Gabriel, welcome. Gabriel, uh, any big teams you look up to? Probably, it's 2017. You can't really be the same as other teams to actually be successful and stuff like that. But obviously, when you're starting off, you have to have the same stuff like sniping scene and stuff like that. We look up to. I wouldn't say we really look up to, but you have to like keep the same momentum to start off at least until you actually go in fan base, which is something we're actually starting to do a lot more quicker now. So we don't really look up to any current teams right now. It's just kind of like doing our own thing as of right now. The next uh, one we have here is from Abel Slayer. And he asked, Abel Uprising, why is Abel Slayer such a beautiful man? And I will well, gladly you know what? He, Actually, I'm talking. I would have really appreciated it uh, if you didn't interrupt me. Thank you. Uh, I'm very sorry Abel about Slayer, that. I would love to agree with you but at the same time since Abel Slayer is my brother and he's ugly I'm gonna have to deny mm. that thanks why okay. is Abel Slayer such a beautiful man that's like asking like why did Donald Trump get elected we all know why that's also like do not like bring asking. politics on this video Vera asks when did you guys start YT and how did you all meet well I know Say YouTube, I just YouTube you cuck <laughs> <laughs> all right <laughs> <laughs> Come on. <laughs> when did we start YouTube? About probably seven, eight, seven and a half months ago when we actually created the team. And when did we all meet? Well, Solaire is my brother. And like you said, Cobra, I met Cobra. And then everything else from there basically was from through recruitment challenge stuff. And yeah, we basically picked up players as we went. Corey BB asks, hashtag ask Abel, when will Abel Jonan get cut? Uh, soon. Yeah, very, very soon. soon. Very soon. Very uh, soon. Very soon. Like, we were actually going to drop him before this, but they said they had to start practice, so we didn't need to, you know, yes, go and interrupt yeah. him. Uh -huh. So the next question is coming in from Trigger, and he asks, how do you guys think the new recruits will affect the team? Uh, obviously, when we, every time we put on a new recruitment challenge, we're looking for new players, and the more new players we introduce under the roster, the more better because we can get our name out there, and we can help other people out. Uh, it'll affect the team in, like, a positive way, if anything, because we're, like, the more people you can bring in under a team through an RC or something like that, it's more talent that you're bringing under the roster, which is helping the name grow. Alright, guys, thank you guys all for submitting your questions for the hashtag AskAble. We will definitely be doing some of this more in the future. Maybe we can do it with the CS team or maybe with more of the members or something like that. I don't know. If you guys did enjoy this video, make sure you guys slap a like on it. We have some new series and new videos coming to the Able Tunnel very soon. Like I said, if you guys did enjoy, make sure you guys hit the like button. It's been Able Aso, and I'm out. Peace.